Release of the student and staff of NICT Urumi fitted into the air on Sunday night and brought excitement to the people of Uboha, Urumi, who have been anxious for the safe arrival of their daughters. Some residents who thank God for the safe return of the victims ask authorities to beef up security in the schools in the locality before students and workers can get confidence to return to school. They said that the school is the only higher educational institution in the area and will not want it closed down because of insecurity. Uh want the federal government to provide adequate security measures on that school, uh, uh, inside the school and along the road, so that nothing of those of, uh, such uh, will happen again. The security in terms of uh, uh, providing the soldiers to man the, uh, the areas. We, we give glory to God for having brought them back safely. Without any there are a lot of jubilation here in Europe. Because the staff and the students that uh, the kidnapper has kidnapped a few days ago, we have uh, added the security agency and helped us to rescue them. That also called the jubilation here in this town. And this is the school we have here in our metropolis here. So, beside that, other states and other states, anybody stays in uh, Nigeria are in this school. Most of them are students in this school. So, if this kind of thing happens again, I believe so they will leave the school. Meanwhile, the public relations officer, NICT, Uromi, Mr. Nucho Edward, said proper security arrangements will be put in place for the school to reopen. As the tradition demands, when people are being rescued from the hands of our doctors after spending about uh, four days in the jungle, it is normal to take them for medical examination after which they are reunited with their family. They are happily reunited with their family as of now. We have suspended academic activities indefinitely until normalcy you know, returns. It is for the good of uh, the students, for the good of the staff, and the good of every member of the ACU community. It was gathered that the victims were rescued by a combined team of security personnel, including the vigilant group in Uromi. Ferdinand Usakwe reporting.